God help us? There is an interior place just above my right ear, two inches into my skull. It is a curl shape, a golden mean of air. It has been with me since the beginning. It is where I know myself and what is true. It is a very patient spot and knows and feels what is real and what is not. Lying in my bed working on this piece, verbose, boring, self-pitying, I am a cliche. The pandemic has happened and I am at sea. I can't find the real new me. Rendered helpless and pulled asunder as we were during AIDS with so much unknown. Back then, it was fatherless girl makes wrong love choices, ends up alone. No. Men used to love me because I talked in a way they didn't understand. They thought I was drunk. Are you sure you're not stoned? No. My brain does naturally what other people take drugs to try to get to. I loved being different. But nobody wanted different, except the gay men. And anyway, I was commitment phobic. In those days, sex and I were very free. He wore an orange parka, a knit cap, snow boots, and he had a self-effacing way of talking. I craved his voice. I wanted to join with the sound. I was obsessed. We fumbled through a thousand cigarettes, neither admitting it wasn't us we wanted. It was something else. He couldn't do it and apologized. Many years later, I found out it was because he was gay. I had had no say in the matter because I needed something that wasn't there, something that lived around us in the air. Dancing taught me how to be social and all my senses got rearranged. I saw with different body parts stretching into shapes and felt with sound. I watched in silence the calculation of time and distance. Hearing was intuition through moving to music in space. Touching was tactile interaction with other bodies like science, not tenderness. I needed to be airborne. In Adagio class, if the guy got my hips just right, he lifted me up over his head and I flew. So the curl shape of air is the attic and also the basement, a Houdini satellite autonomous and knowing. It hovers over me with men, even if I'm down in flames, ashes, embers, alone and glowing. One astrologer told me I could talk a man to death, which I thought was insulting. <laughs> I just wanted to say what I felt was true. I saw things in their eyes like galaxies. <laughs> as long as I'm alone and longing, I'm safe and have a referendum. All I wanted was intimacy and sharing, but sex was forbidden and I was terrified. All I saw was AIDS. In dancing school, the guy at the desk was yellowish. And then he was dead. There was a feeling of everything being upended and crazy. You never knew who was going to be sick next and for no reason. So the gay man who loved me, I was suddenly terrified of and couldn't answer the door. When he came over, I pretended not to be home. I was too embarrassed to tell him. But in the hospital, 
walking down the hallway, holding my other friend's hand. We still didn't know what was wrong. It was no man's land. No one cared. I wanted obsession and the tenderness gay men wanted, but I wanted sex too. What a dilemma. No one's ever said such things, so many men have said. I describe the world I saw above his head. A supernatural imagined place came the night the first one died. From then on, I knew and felt way beyond our eyes. There's a place I want to meet you in between the dawn and dusk. I want you in my lining. I won't keep being husk. The earth meets the sky for one brief second. The great vast is shared and known. I know you won't want to know this, so I'll go home alone. Epidemic AIDS brought strength to those who cared. Pandemonium taught our will to hold the burden that we shared. And now we've somersaulted fresh pandemic chaos. We must wake up from now on amid tremendous loss. I'm no longer spider-like and blown from string to web, landing in whatever place. I long for love instead. The world is brutal, wild, and lost. We are shipwrecked, tempest-tossed. Sounds and dirt and birds and trees unite us softly, bidding ease. Each small thing is all that's needed. In times of urgency, the call is heeded. Stretch your hand to over here. And with my real ears and yours, curl shape toward my open mind. Come take solace, I am kind. No more cause to calculate, take flight. Freedom is innate. It's all so simple. Love is all. I will catch your fall. <laughs>